Hey, what's up everybody? Chris here from the Protocase team with another Proto Tech Tip. And today I'm gonna to cover copper bus bars. So bus bars are form strips or bars of copper that are typically housed inside of an enclosure or board in order to distribute large amounts of current. Copper bus bars are also useful for mounting components and dissipating heat. We can build your custom copper bus bars in two to three days in any quantity that you require. And these bus bars can be a part of a custom enclosure design or ordered as a standalone part that you need. So let's go over a few things that you need to know about copper bus bars. First, the material. We stock copper alloy C110, which is a general purpose copper alloy designated in ASTM standard B152. That is a mouthful. And copper C110 has very high conductivity and offers excellent formability, which makes it an awesome choice for electrical and electronic applications. We offer four different thicknesses of copper, and if you require another thickness for your project, let us know and we may be able to order it as a non-stocked item for an additional lead time and cost. So let's talk bending. So as I mentioned, C110 copper has excellent formability, which means that we can bend it to the shape that you require for your specific application. A couple things to note though, when it comes to bending, as with all of the metals that we offer, there are some minimum bend dimensions and bend radii guidelines to follow. We've got all of those details on our website for you to check out. And if you want to discuss a different bend radius for your copper bus bar idea, our engineering team would be happy to chat. Next with fasteners, we recommend sticking with stainless steel self-clenching fasteners for two reasons. Stainless steel is the ideal material to match copper for compatibility reasons. And as well, self-clenching fasteners are ideal because the copper alloy is so soft in nature. So you can technically torque fasteners into tapped holes on copper if you're really careful, but we generally don't recommend it if at all possible. So sticking with stainless steel self-clenching fasteners is going to be your best bet. Finally, let's talk finishes. Typically copper bus bars are left unfinished in order to have the most electrical conductivity possible. Copper left unfinished will eventually oxidize and discolor into patina, which is a thin layer of greenish color on the surface. And as you can see from this part that I have in my hand, it's been kept inside our facility for over five years, and you can kind of see the discoloration compared to a part that was just cut recently at our facility. So if you do want to apply a finish to your copper bus bar, you have a couple of options. For one, you can opt to have your bus bars tin plated. Tin plating is a simple immersion technique that deposits pure tin onto copper. This creates a bus bar with improved corrosion resistance, electrical conductivity, and solderability. So one thing to note about tin plating, this process is completed by a third party supplier. So there will be an additional lead time and cost. You'll need to factor that increased lead time for your project planning if you need copper bus bars that are going to be treated with tin plating. Now you can also technically opt for powder coating your copper bus bars, but powder coating will affect the bus bar's electrical conductivity. So you're gonna to need to specify the contact areas where you'd like masking applied. So when you do that, the entire part won't be powder coated. So to sum up, we can make your custom copper bus bars in any quantity that you require, either as a standalone order or as a part of a larger build that you're completing. And remember to keep our minimum bend radius recommendations in mind and stick with stainless steel self-clenching fasteners at all possible times. We've got links below to a few other proto tech tips that you may find helpful, including a specific tech tip about tin plating. We are here to keep your projects on track and meet your deadlines, so if you have an idea or a design of copper bus bars that you need to get made quickly, just get in touch with us. Thanks very much for watching this week's proto tech tip, and we'll be back again next week with another one.